This is new research, yeah. relatively new research. It's also the only research still that looks at changes in women's brains as a woman goes through the different phases of menopause. Okay. So this is before menopause when everything is nice and red and bright. And as you can see, changing, the red is turning yellow and the yellow is turning green. And after menopause, the entire brain scan is a lot greener than before menopause. There's a lot less red and yellow and a lot more green. And what that means, quantitatively, that's a 30% drop in brain energy levels, which means that your neurons are able, they have access to the sugar, to the glucose, but they're not burning it as fast or perhaps as efficiently as they used to. And the reason that this is so important, there are two reasons that I believe this is very important. Number one, this validates what women have been saying for hundreds, if not thousands of years, that there's something happening in their heads, that they feel like their brain is changing, the feeling of, I don't feel like myself anymore, or there's something happening, I have the brain fog, I have mental fatigue. In clinical terms, we say cognitive fatigue, mental fatigue. And this is actually evidence of what women have been saying all along, that menopause changes your brain as surely as it changes your ovaries and very specifically changes the functionality of your brain. That menopause also impacts the structure of the brain, the volume of the brain, the connectivity of the brain, blood flow to the brain. So menopause really is a renovation project on the brain.